What is good, boys? We are back on stake. We have $3,000 in the balance and we are running another fan strategy tournament. This one is set up a little bit differently. We have a leaderboard and for the first round, we'll try them all and the three best ones are going to move on. After that, in round two, the two best ones are going to move on and then we'll decide the winner who will also receive a $100 stake tip. So without any further ado, let's get right to the first one. We're going to run all the strategies with $300 and for two minutes and 30 seconds in the first round for this one we select four bombs we use a 20 cent starting bet and on every loss we're going to increase by 77 percent and we just select all these tiles so let's just get right into it we start the timer we start the auto bet and hopefully we start printing some money as well let's see what we can do with this one the base bet amount is going up pretty fast um but we are fine so far up a little bit the more losses we get i think the more money we are gonna win as well as long as we do get that hit in the end of course <laughs> otherwise it could also rip us but let's just keep it going we still have two minutes on the timer and hopefully we should get to maybe like 50 or 100 dollars of profit with this one Obviously, some of these strats are absolutely risky, some are more safe, um, but that doesn't mean the risky one is going to win the tournament, because they could obviously also just rip the whole balance. So it is going to be exciting to see which strat can win it today. So far, so good on this one. We're almost up $20, and we still have a minute and 15 seconds to go here. We haven't really seen any long losing streak so far, which I think that would help boost the profit quite a bit. Um, if we could get maybe like eight losses in a row or something like that, and then we get a hit. But it is still doing pretty good. We have 20 seconds left. Hopefully somehow it can get to like $50 of profit. That would be pretty nice in these last seconds, but we'll have to see. I do think we need a losing streak to get there. $40 and five seconds left. It's gonna be close, but I guess not quite close close enough that is time let's stop it here 41 dollars of profit not bad at all for this score we're gonna put in whatever balance they are at but let's move on to the next one it is a dragon tower strategy for this one we're gonna put it to easy mode we're gonna select exactly these tiles right here on every loss will increase by 90 percent and for the starting bet amount we'll use 25 cents so let's get right into it and let's see how much money we can make with this one timer is starting as well i feel like this is probably a lot riskier than the mines one already because yeah we are going for a 3x multiplier and we have a pretty big um increase on loss and a really big base bet as well so it could either absolutely rip or maybe print some big big profits which i'm really really hoping for so far so good though we're already up 30 dollars actually kind of insane um, so yeah, let's see what happens. We still have like 1 minute and 50 seconds remaining. We have like 50 seconds remaining and so far so good. We're up to $80 of profit. We haven't really seen any too big losing streaks. So it hasn't really gotten too scary. I think every time we got to like $11 bet, we somehow hit it right then. So let's see, we should easily get over $100 of profit with this one. Real quick boys, if you do want to try out steak for yourself and get $7 for absolutely free, just use code COPPER right here at sign up. If you already made an account, simply click on the the little guy in the top go over to settings click on offers and here you can enter code copper up to 24 hours after you've made your account and once again it got to 11 dollars and we got that hit can't really complain about that it's running pretty pretty smoothly here we have like 22 seconds to go all right, there we saw a $22 bet. That got a little bit more scary, but still we had more than enough in the balance. And again, 22. All right, we're up to the last 10 seconds here. Just don't fuck it up in the end, please. $160 of profit. Absolutely amazing. The time is up though. So let's stop it right here. 159. That is really, really good. This next strategy that we have is a wheel strat. We're going to put it to high risk 10 segments. On every loss, we increase by 15%. And for the base bet amount, he said to use 0.1% of the balance, which would be 30 cents. So without any further ado, once again, let's hope it prints some money. Let's start the timer and just get right into it. I feel like this one is definitely risky as well, because you can get some huge losing streaks. I'm um, going for a 10x multi. 
So let's see what happens though. So far, so good, I guess. Base bet is going up pretty fast as well though. So let's see what will happen with this one. So far, so good, boys. We have a minute and 20 seconds remaining, and we're already up 40 bucks. So far, I don't think we've gotten to a $2 bet. Right now, we did, though. Um, but yeah, the more losses in a row, the bigger the hit is going to be with this one, because we are increasing by 15%, but only going for a 10x here. And there we go. Base bet is going up. Nice, dude. Okay, we're up to $70 of profit now, and we still have a minute on the clock. So let's see. Should get over $100, probably unless it somehow rips, of course. All right, boys, base bet is getting kind of big. We're at $4. We do need a hit here. And the timer is on 10 seconds. Oh, God, huge bets. Please get us a hit. Come on, dude. Please. Oh, it might rip. And the time is up right now, just as we pretty much rip. Um, I guess we'll do one more manual mode just to see. Please hit this. And it doesn't. Okay, that is the first strategy that actually ripped. That was kind of unlucky, but it does happen. This next strategy is a limbo strat. We're going to be going for a 3.5x multiplier. And on every loss, we'll be increasing by 50%. For the base bet amount, we are going to use 50 cents. So it is pretty risky as well well let's just start it and let's hope it is gonna work out good for us um oh god please hit <laughs> nice dude okay we got that hit that was really really important right there on stream we tried something similar to this with a 3x though and a bigger um increase on loss and we tried it in the video as well actually but on stream it paid like 1.5 grand which was absolutely mad so i am hoping this one can do good as well just looking at the base bit amount it is it is very very risky though we are also already up a hundred dollars so we just have to keep going and get a hit every now and then and we should be able to maybe get like $200 of profit with this if we don't rip in the two minutes and 30 seconds that is we still have a minute and 40 left so I am a little bit worried about this one to be honest but let's see what happens Wow, we just saw a 6,000x right there. That's just Limbo. I feel like on Limbo, you see these things so, so much um, compared to like Dice or something. But so far, so good. You were almost at 200 already. Still a minute and 10 seconds remaining though. I really, really hope this one can just keep going smoothly and print us that profit. Huge losing streak. Oh my God. Okay, there we go. <laughs> it's just so, so risky. We still have 35 seconds remaining here, though. And we are up over $250. I feel like with, with our balance right now, we should be able to sustain a good amount of losses. But then again, increased by 50%. It can get up there really, really fast as well. We still have 15 seconds now. So come on, just get us over like 300. And then just let's chill, you know. Don't rip the balance, please. <laughs> Hopefully I don't jinx it or anything but around the last five seconds i think we should be fine here and the time is up let's stop it 310 dollars of profit by far the best one so far this next strategy is another one that printed insane profit on our last stream so I thought we have to give it another try here. The base bet amount is going to be one cent and we're going to divide that once. And here we have the conditions. On every loss, we increase by 120%. Every two bets, we switch over under. Every streak of four losses, we add to the win chance 10%. Every streak greater than four losses, we increase the bet amount by another 140%. And then on every win, we're going to reset the bet amount and also the win chance. The multiplier for this one is a 3x. So let's get right into it. I really, really hope this one can print like crazy again, just the way it did on stream. But I feel like this might be the riskiest strategy that we are trying today. Um, so we'll see. Yeah, as you can see, it just went up $60 there. It could have easily ripped as well. So I'm kind of excited to see if this one prints like $500 of profit or if it's just gonna lose. 
Even though we have such a low base bet, like half a cent, it can just explode like absolutely crazy. And I mean, it can go both ways, either jump up huge or jump down like it just did now. Apparently we didn't have enough in the balance to bet though. So that means we didn't actually lose that much. We lost our profit and a little bit more. That means we can just reset it here though. And hopefully it can keep paying profits or I mean, not keep paying, but get back into the green. Um, that was a little bit unlucky, but at least it didn't bet our whole balance. So we have another chance here, pretty much. Let's see what happens though. Only 45 seconds remaining on the time. I think it could easily still get to like a hundred dollars of profit, to be honest. We'll have to see though, we'll have to see. All right, we have 20 seconds on the timer. I mean, this is really gonna make or break it. If it somehow gets one more big hit. Oh wait, it just did. That means it could move on to the next round. We still have seven seconds remaining though. Wow, it actually got to 100. Are we gonna rip? Oh my God, and time is up <laughs> just as that happened. 155. So it went up, it went back down and now we're up even further. That is really good. And that means it might get into the next round. We'll have to see though. The last strategy for the first round is going to be a Kino strat. On every loss, we increase 75%. For the risk, we'll put it to high risk. And the base bet amount is only one cent, um, but it can really increase quite fast. So let's just start it as well with instant bet and let's see what happens. I do kind of really like these Kino strategies. Um, so yeah, let's see. Hopefully it can pay some big profit. We need a hit, dude. Oh my God, there is no way. We did not get a single hit right now. And we started with a one cent bet. We're gonna have to go all in. It would have increased more than we have in the balance. So I guess, let's see, can we get a hit? Wow, we really can't. That is absolutely disappointing and really, really unlucky though. So here you can see the strategies that are moving on to the second round. Insane Stice Strat, the Dragon Tower Strat, and the Limbo Strategy. Total points is just the balance that we ended up with. Obviously, these two down here, they ripped our whole balance, so they don't have a single point. But let's see what happens in the second round. We're going to start off the next round with the Dragon Tower Strategy. Let's just get right into it. This time, we are going to do two minutes each and a $400 balance. So they have a little bit more room room to play with so to say um so yeah let's just get right into it let's see what happens i mean this one did quite decently um in the first round as all the other ones obviously that we are gonna try next um so yeah let's see already up 15 dollars hopefully it can print like maybe 100 or 150 again that would be really really nice it really feels like most of the time, once the bet amount goes up, we keep hitting on that $11 bet. Not really sure why, but it seems like kind of a safe spot. So let's see. Okay, wait, we actually missed it. Oh God, please hit. Nice. Oh wait, that was actually huge. That was absolutely huge, dude. We're up $200 now. We still have a whole minute remaining though. Um, so hopefully we can just keep that profit, maybe get it to like 300. That would be very, very nice. That got very risky as well though right there. Let's just see what happens. Huge base bet again, $40. Okay, we're almost at 300 now, dude. And again, dude, why, why do we get so many losing streaks now? I mean, I shouldn't be complaining because we are printing money, but it is just a tiny bit scary because I don't really want to rip after being up $300. Let's see though, 20 seconds remaining on the time. Surely we can just secure this profit right here. And the time is right about up right now. So let's stop it here. $331. That is actually amazing. We have 731 in the balance. So now we are back with the limbo strategy. Let's see how much this one is going to pay or if it's going to rip. I mean, hopefully not. Hopefully all these three can just pay. And then the best two of them are going to move on to the last round, to the finals. Um, so yeah, let's see which ones it's going to be. If all all of them pay it's probably gonna be quite close if one of them rips then obviously it's quite clear which ones are gonna move on um so yeah we're gonna just keep it running we still have a minute and 30 and we're already up 50 dollars so i feel like if this one doesn't rip it might even beat the dragon tower one actually i'm not quite sure i guess i guess we'll find out 
huge bets. Okay, we got it on $28 there. Actually, now I'm pretty sure it's not gonna be the Dragon Tower one. Um, because after a minute, we're up like a hundred. And obviously, the Dragon Tower one paid like 300 So it is gonna be interesting because we also have the dice strategy after this one. Um, so let's just hope this one stays in the green, and then we'll see if the dice strategy can beat this one to move on, or if Limbo is gonna move on. Let's see though. We still have 35 seconds remaining. $150 of profit. That is really, really good. Can't complain at all, dude. We are at the last 10 seconds now, so I'm ready to stop it here. Would be so, so sad if it somehow manages to rip, but the time is up. Let's stop it. Nice, dude. $204. That is amazing. So obviously for the dice strategy, that means it has to be $204 of profit. Let's see if we can actually do that. I mean, if it's not going to go down and then up later, it might be able to do it if we just keep going up. Um, so yeah, without any further ado, let's we'll start the timer and let's see what happens. I'm not sure which one I prefer to move on. Honestly, all these strats in this round right now have been really, really good. So let's just see. It's gonna be <laughs> pretty much up to luck. We are up $20 now. I mean, as I said, this one can explode like crazy. So if it does actually do that and does not rip in the end, it could even manage to profit more than the Dragon Tower one. But I guess we'll find out. We still have a minute and 30 on the timer. We're kind of just waiting for a big losing streak with this one. And there we go. That was like a $90 bet right there, I think. Maybe even more, not quite sure. But that means we are up $100 and we have a minute and 12 seconds on the clock. Yeah, this is going to be really interesting. If this one doesn't rip i feel like it is gonna be the limbo strategy or even the dragon tower one and we still have a minute so <laughs> oh god dude let's see though let's see oh my god guys it just <laughs> kind of absolutely ripped we have 20 seconds left on the clock and i mean it was gonna increase a whole bunch so i guess we just go all in and we'll see what happens and we lose <laughs> that hurts a little bit um yeah that is not too good but that means we know which strategies are moving on so now we have the Dragon Tower versus Rashan's Limbo strategy. And keep in mind, the winner of this final round will receive a $100 stake tip as well. For this last round, we have $500 for each of them. And obviously, we'll just run them the exact same way as before. Only 1 minute 30 on the timer though. So let's see what is gonna happen. As of now, I think we are overall up like $200. So if one of these rips... We are going to be down some money, but if they both can print a little bit more of profit here, we'll even end the video with overall profit, which would be obviously <laughs> very nice as well. Um, so yeah, let's see. We have a minute remaining here. So far, we are up $60. Not bad at all. Let's just hope it keeps going like that. Kind of for this strategy to win, we want to see like a big, big losing streak and then get a really big hit. Um, but yeah, let's see if that happens. We have 25 seconds remaining and we just got up a $40 bet there again. Not bad at all though. We're up $120. Obviously, the bigger the losing streak, the bigger the profit. So for this strategy, it is very, very beneficial to get a lot of losses in a row before we actually get that hit. We just got it at $6 again there. Really, really good. But the time is up right now. So we're going to end it. $138. That's what the limbo strategy has to be. All right, boys. Here we go. 3.5x. 50% increase on loss. Let's see, dude. I mean, this could be really, really close. It is climbing already pretty fast as well, though. So I'm kind of really excited to see which one is going to win this tournament. And obviously also that $100 stake tip. But I do feel like the way it is moving up right now, I think it's going to get more profit than the Dragon Tower one. Unless, of course, it does rip the whole balance. That could still happen as well. So we'll have to see. We have like 55 seconds remaining still. And we got a pretty good losing streak there. Boosts up the profit even more. Okay, wait. This is actually getting super close, dude. 44 seconds remaining. Yeah, this is <laughs> this is like insanely close. Like it could get there, but it could also just fall short by a couple dollars maybe. 
We have 30 seconds. Oh god, dude. Okay, now it's moving up pretty good. It's at 100. Oh god, dude. <laughs> this is actually way, way closer than I ever thought it would be. Um, 18 seconds remaining. I'm ready to press stop auto bet to keep this fair. Oh my god, dude. It's so close. Is it gonna rip? We need a hit. Wow, dude. Five seconds remaining. And I think it beat it. And let's stop it. No, wait. Oh my god. It lost, right? 134 versus 138. Oh my god, dude. That is absolutely insane. I actually thought the Limbo Strat lost because of that last round, but because it made a lot more profit, or not even a lot more, just a tiny bit more profit in the earlier rounds, it has more total points. And that means Rashan won the $100 stake tip. And also, we managed to make a profit of almost $500, which is really, really good for just running a random strategy tournament. As you can see, boys, we're sending out the tip right away as well. Congrats to you for winning this tournament. If you guys enjoyed the video, please leave a like, a comment that helps me out so, so much. Don't forget to subscribe and I'll see you in the next one. Peace out.